This is just one of the beautiful scenes, folks, on the road from Rideau to Tonopah. You need to stick along with us, come along with us, and stay to the end of the journey to see more beautiful, beautiful scenery like this. Yabba dabba doo! <laughs> Papa Dale here, and uh, Bandit and I are on our way from Lapine Campground, Oregon State Campground. Uh, to uh, uh, either the Slab City, probably go to Slab City before we go anywhere else. I want to see Slab City and there behind me of course is uh, William Falcon and the tracker and uh, back over here is Bandit looking for a place to go potty. He's got to water all the bushes uh, between uh, Lapine and Klamath Falls. Klamath Falls is where we are uh, Klamath Falls, Oregon, and uh, it's a Walmart store here, uh, and I'm going to go in and get some prescriptions filled and buy a few groceries. I haven't, haven't bought groceries in quite a while, so that's what the plan is for right now, so we'll catch up with you just a little later. <laughs> <laughs> Hi, friends. Papa Dale, and back here is the bandit right behind me there. And we have just left Klamath Falls. We are traveling on US Highway 39 headed towards Reno, Nevada. The biggest little city in the West, I think, is how they build themselves. And uh, so off we go. We're going to go to Reno and spend the night probably again in a Walmart parking lot. I've got some, some more things to pick up. When I went into Walmart last night, I didn't take my list with me. I didn't actually, ha I hadn't made my list. And so the end result was uh, I missed a bunch of things. The reason I had stopped at that Walmart is because I wanted to get prescriptions filled. See, uh... Papa is, uh, is not the healthiest cat on the scratch and post. <laughs> so I take a lot of uh, prescription meds and uh, I do uh, take a lot of over-the-counter uh, supplements as well, trying to keep my uh, heart in shape and my cardiovascular system in shape so that I can be out on the road and enjoy this and shoot these videos for my family and for you. So uh, anyway, I'm going to hit that Walmart in Reno. There are several of them right there. So I got my choice. <laughs> and uh, we're going to finish uh, getting some groceries here. And then we're going to be on our way down the highway towards Las Vegas and Lake Havasu City. So yeah, da dabba doo! <laughs> is the California countryside that got burned up recently in the wildfires. Since of fires in Oregon, any life in them has been burnt out. Ones that didn't get burned. Grasses and the sagebrush. So i show this for contrast. This is, uh, this is the view from a pull-off off of California 139 between Klamath Falls and Reno. Just a real pretty Andoric Lake. And I thought I'd stop and get a little video of it just to give you an idea of some of the beautiful scenery that I've been passing by here. <laughs> well, here we are, Bandit and Papa. Bandit had to uh, stop and take a little water break here. Right, Bandit? 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 Bandit! Bandit, come here! Come here! Bandit, come here. Say hi to the people. Bandit, come here. Oh, he doesn't want to say hi to the people. 
Oh, he wants to pee. He wants to sniff. All right, that's all right. Ah, well, this is just a little uh, pull off on the side of the road. Looks like the highway used to uh, actually take a big turn right in here, and and they straightened it out some. But of course, the old highway's still kind of back in here. But there's the Millennium Falcon back there, trackers behind it. But uh, Bandit and I are off uh, walking through some of the bushes here, walking down the road, making sure we can get out of here when we need to. So Bandit is just trying real hard to sniff, 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 but I'm not letting him too far off uh, away from me because I don't know what uh, things might be lurking in these bushes that... Uh, might be harmful to him. I think it's too late in the year for snakes. I'm not too worried about that. I think they've all gone into their burrows and uh, they're staying warm in there because it's uh, it gets pretty cold at night still here. But you can see the beautiful countryside out there. California is a beautiful place. Too bad it's uh, filled up with uh, so many people that don't take very good care of it with some of their stupid behaviors and some of their stupid laws. Anyway, well, I'll get off that soapbox. <laughs> Klamath Falls to Reno, Nevada. Another very large endoric lake. Endoric just means there's no outlet. It's just a, a great basin that fills with water. Turning a little pink. This is a wonderful view on the way from Klamath Falls, Oregon to Reno, Nevada. It's on uh, California Highway 395. I've been editing and Facebooking and relaxing at the dinette table. And I look down, and this is what I see after uh, 30 minutes or so of doing my own thing. I look down, and this is what I see. I think, somebody, Bandit, have you been trying to get my attention? Yeah, Papa, I have been. But you just have been busy and have been ignoring me. Well, I'm sorry, but I just had things to do. <laughs> Bandit? 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 Are you mad at me? No, I still love you, Papa, but now I'm just going to lay my head down right here and I'm going to rest. Okay. <laughs> Quite a view up here, friends, from the top of this hill, right next to the Reno Walmart. <laughs> so I'm doing a little bit of shopping here in Walmart, and I found this product that I just had to share with you. Look at this nice big bag of popcorn. It's awesome. I love popcorn. The only challenge is, as I feel the bag, it feels kind of light, and then when I go to feel where the popcorn is, the popcorn is right here. The whole rest of this bag is air. Wow. <laughs> I'm just blown away. No bark. <laughs> 
<laughs> Bandit, because I stopped, Bandit thinks it's time for him to get out. <laughs> but we aren't stopped for long. This is just a scenic viewpoint on the road between uh, Reno and the um, Miller's Rest Stop, just outside of Tonopah, Nevada, where I plan to spend the night. But it's beautiful here, so I thought that I would give you uh, a shot of some of the beautiful scenery uh, coming from Reno. Now I know the sun's right in your eyes there, so you may not be able to see some of that right there, and I apologize for that. But uh, on each end of this valley, it's uh, pretty beautiful. You look right down in the bottom of the valley there, you can see a wonderful river in between the trees. It's just a gorgeous place. On the road in Nevada. <laughs> this is a nice little BLM campground right next to Lake Walker in uh, Nevada. Again, it's between uh, Reno and uh, Tonopah. And it's a very large uh, endoric lake, uh, no outlet. Uh, uh, water comes in from the mountains all around and fills the lake and it just evaporates uh, over time. So, um, nice little campground. We stopped here to have a little bite of lunch and to uh, check out the beauty of the lake. You can see that uh, it is quite beautiful. The stark contrast of the water and the mountains, the shadows and the light is uh, very, very beautiful. And of course, Bandit's out here and he's enjoying finding new things to sniff and to water. <laughs> Let's show you some of the mountains more close up on the other side. Well, here you see the uh, Millennium Falcon and the Tracker, and behind them you see beautiful Nevada rugged, rugged mountains. It's a gorgeous, gorgeous place right here. It's a BLM camping, at least that's what the sign said, so I'm assuming like most BLM campgrounds, it's probably a 14-day stay and free. There's no uh, camp host or anything. There's absolutely nobody here until I pulled in and then this guy decided, oh, well, if that Papa and the Bandit guy's gonna pull in here, I think maybe I'll pull in here too. <laughs> anyway, so that's what we're doing. We're stopping for a bite of lunch and maybe a quick nap. And then uh, off we continue to Tonopah. Oh my, look at the, look at the beautiful mountains straight out there. Let me see if I can get a little more of a close-up on that. Isn't that pretty? And the slopes, the green slopes going up to that mountain. So, boy, that's... God paints some beautiful, beautiful portraits, doesn't he? Okay, time for lunch. <laughs> well, Bandit and I are uh, still here at Lake Walker. Uh, just finished lunch and had a little nap. <coughs> and we've got the uh, last little leg of our trip today uh, to navigate to get to Tonopah, Nevada. That's where we're headed. <clears throat> Looking forward to Tonopah. Going to spend the night and spend uh, some of the day there tomorrow. And uh, going to look around and see some of the sites. I understand that uh, Wyatt Earp owned a uh, uh, saloon there at one time. And so I'm uh, hoping that saloon is still there. Looking forward to uh, seeing that, looking through that. That'll be kind of fun. So uh, on the road, here we go. Uh, headed to Tonopah, and uh, other than uh, Wyatt Earp's saloon, uh, 
The thing we got to ask is, what's next? Ha 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 ha.